Hi everyone, this is Mukta Sharma. Yesterday, somebody sent me a message and asked me to prepare collections in API. So let's first discuss what are collections in API, what all different type of operations you can perform on API. And with the help of one real-time example, we will try to understand it in a more efficient way. So collection is a set of different multiple HTTP requests. You must be aware of get, post, put, delete type of request, right? If you are working in API testing. If you have used Postman tool, you will see an option to create collection. It will be on the top menu bar when you see collections. So in real-time uh, projects in companies, mostly collections are provided by developers team, by your developers or the uh, backend team. Whoever is working, whoever is designing the APIs, they will provide you a collection of APIs that you can import in Postman, there is an option to import uh, the collection in Postman. So you will click on import and uh, import the collections given by your developer. Then you will see a list of different HTTP requests in one collection. Let's uh, understand what all operations we can do on collection. Like you can do all the operations, um, get, post, put, delete, all these type of operations can be performed on collection. Collection can be understood um, like a list or a specific folder. Let's say, um, let's say I have this playlist in uh, playlist on my YouTube channel, right? You can go to that playlist. Either you can see all the videos at once, or if you want one particular video, you can see the particular video. And since I am the cre creator of that playlist, I can delete one video from the playlist, or I can remove the entire playlist, right? So APIs collection APIs work in the similar way in real time projects. If you have any more questions related to collections, please write down in the comment and please let me know if you find this video useful. Yeah, I will see you in the another video. Till then, take care of yourself. Bye.